Hi Knitters, it's Tuesday. So today we're supposed to talk about um, other hobbies that we have. Um, of course I have knitting and crocheting and sometimes I cross stitch. And of course I read, this is what I'm reading right now. Um, it's the third book in the, um, the uh, Pretty Little Liars series, which I'm totally addicted to on television. Television, I think, is my number one. It's probably tied with knitting and crocheting. Because I have to have something to do while I'm knitting and crocheting. Um, and then I think it would be reading. Um, and I'm a couponer. And when I say couponer, I don't mean here and there. And I am a couponer. <laughs> this is another one of my hobbies. I have tons and tons and tons of coupons. I have them organized and... I keep track of what's coming out every week. Um, I belong, or I, I follow several blogs that post each week what's coming out in the newspaper. Um, as far as the um, the circulars that you can get, you can cut out the, the like the red plum and the smart source and all that. You guys are too young. You probably don't know um, about all that kind of couponing. You probably know take a coupon. To, I mean, I'm not sure what you guys know, but this is how I fund my yarn addiction. <laughs> so, anyway, um, I usually generally save between 50 and sometimes 75, very rarely 75%. Mostly, it's between 50 and 60% when I go to the grocery store. Sometimes I can save more, um, but that is how I save money for our family um, and that's how um, since I don't make a paycheck that's how I stretch our money further but that's a hobby of mine I spend um, probably a good hour um, when I buy the coupons like I haven't bought coupons I haven't bought a newspaper on Sunday probably in the last three weeks there's not really been any that I use or that I will use um, in there so, or anything that I need. Like, I've got enough toothpaste to last me probably, I don't know, till summer. Maybe a little after, probably, maybe even, might, might even last me till the fall. So, um, you know, and the same thing with shampoo and conditioner and um, razors, you know, things like that. I've stocked up on whenever I can get them free or next to nothing. Um, so, you know, that's just, that's one of my hobbies. And when I buy coupons, when I buy the paper on Sunday, I usually buy three um, of the Charlotte Observer, which is our big paper around here. And uh, I end up spending probably an hour and a half to two hours Sunday afternoon clipping the coupons and putting them into my binder. Um, and once a month, I spend probably about an hour and a half to two hours um, getting all of the coupons out that are expired and putting them into a bag and I've got a friend who mails them off they have a family in Japan it's an American um, uh, military family in Japan they're stationed over there in the commissaries just so you guys know in the commissaries which are the grocery stores on military bases the manufacturing coupons the ones that you get in the paper um, the manufacturers allow the commissary to take the coupon up to three months or six months like I think it's six months up to six months after its expiration date um, and that's how they're helping the families that are overseas so she mails them over there I can't afford to mail the things but she usually mails a big old box once a month and so she just adds mine to it so um, which I'm really glad that she does that because <laughs> um, I can't afford to mail them so anyway, um, those are my extracurricular hobbies. Um, I am enjoying right now as far as TV goes. Um, I have a big long list of Bones and Castle and Pretty Little Liars and uh, Terra Nova when it comes back on. And um, let's see, what else comes on? Um, Glee and Ringer. And the new girl with Zoe De Chanel. I love Zoe De Chanel. She's awesome. Um, the Walking Dead, uh, Vampire Diaries, and Secret Circle. Which, if you haven't read any of those books, you really need to read those books. Book recommendation. 
Um, let's see, Supernatural, um, I already said The Walking Dead, Merlin when it comes back on, I cannot believe Merlin's not coming on until September, Ugh! starting to film next month, I think, I went and looked that up yesterday, um, so, uh, and Once Upon a Time, uh, those are the shows that I generally watch week to week, and I try and keep up with them, and sometimes I miss a whole week of them, and so, like, the next week, I get to spend trying to catch up on them. Plus, I've just started playing bingo. There's a couple bingo games on Facebook. Um, that's another one of my, my hobby things. But I've run over five minutes, so I will talk to you guys later. Bye! I'll see Kayla tomorrow. Bye! Okay, so I totally forgot to show you what I've been working on. I'll show that to you really, really quick. Alright, so there's this block. And there's two of those. And then there's four of these. You can see that. This is all crochet. Um, and there's four of these. And there's two of these. And there's four of these. And there's going to be four of these. There's only one of these right now. <laughs> um, and it's all crocheted and it's going to be all put together. And I haven't really decided on the pattern yet. Um, this is what I had thought to do right here. Um, the top one right here, and um, but I don't know. I'm gonna lay them out and see how they look, and I will take a picture before I give it um to who I'm making it for, which I don't want to say who I'm making it for, and that's about it. Okay, bye.